All right, welcome to The Light. We're coming to you live from the African American Heritage Museum right here in the heart of Atlantic City at the Stockton Arts Garage. And we're here with our good friend, Ralph Hunter, who has a new show opening next month. Okay, the name of the show is called Jet Black, Brown, and Tan. And it tells the story of John H. Johnson, who is the publisher of Negro Digest that started publishing back in the 40s. And he was able to borrow $500 from his mother's furniture. They had to pawn the furniture to start Negro Digest. And since that period of time, uh, Mr. Johnson has been listed on the Forbes list of 400 as one of the richest people in America. So the John H. Johnson Show will be a tribute to him. He passed away in 05. The company is now closed. They no longer produce the magazine. So we decided to put together an exhibit in his honor. And that exhibit's going to open the 1st of uh, October. And it's going to run through the month of December. And I urge everyone to come take a look at this great exhibit. Okay. You can be able to feel and look at some great old Abbey magazine covers. Okay. Right. Do you remember your first Jet magazine or one of the I first Jet the magazines? First spread. I know that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you remember your favorite too, huh? <laughs> yeah, we can't tell. Well, I mean, I can't tell on national television. Right, uh, right, right. But that has been such an important thing that when people pick up the magazine, they either look for the centerfold or they go right to the back and like look at the, uh, twi the, the top are, 20. You can see um, Jackson, Jackson 5. Michael Jackson, James Brown, of course, uh, um, the young man who played on Cosby. Um, and oh, Theo, uh, Malcolm Jamal Warner. Right. And, of course, you can see the Rat Pack here. Wow. Another one of, of Michael. Another one, of course, of um, Jesse. This is Jesse Jackson. And this, of course, you remember this great show here. And, of course, we have um, Oprah. Oprah. Sugar Ray. Sugar Ray. And of course, Miss Lena Horn, uh, Mike Tyson, and that's not even a an eighth of one percent of the magazines that we have. We have um, more um, Johnson Publication magazines in our collection here at the African American Museum than any other collector in the United States. Okay, so, so the show is going to be opening on the. Uh Second uh, Friday? Yeah. Well, the grand opening is on the second Friday of October, but the show actually opens on the first of October. Okay. All right. And they'll be able to see thousands of magazines. Um, all right, we're just putting the show together now. Okay. And the place will be set up as a um, as a newsstand. There's some more covers, more covers, more covers. I mean, just there's so many. And the most uh, covers ever... In a, in a magazine history uh, from the Ebony Magazine collection was um, the Jackson family and number two was Muhammad Ali. Wow. Most two appeared on, on weekly covers. I, I can see that. I can see that. All right. Well, thank you. Anything else you want to add before I let you go? You no, know, just come out and take a look at this new exhibit and we'll look forward to seeing you guys over at the Arts Noise Grads. And then we'll have an opportunity to share stories and look at some great covers. Thanks a lot. Okay, my pleasure.